Good morning, everybody. So as you can hear, sickness has hit me full-fledged. I just jumped out of the shower, so <sighs> my hair is soaked. No makeup. I'm not putting makeup on today. I feel too much like crap. So <clears throat> my goals for this week, I'm going to keep it really simple. I want to get back to a little bit of a better diet. Um, I mean, I haven't been eating horribly, but... I, uh, I've kind of been eating bagels for breakfast and <laughs> not really that great. So I want to get back to more of a normal routine. I've been walking these dogs morning and noon, so they're making the camera shake like crazy. Um, so I've been in town for breakfast and lunch, so I haven't really been home to make it myself. They're going to play on the couch, so my hand's shaking everywhere. So... I kind of want to get back to a normal routine. I still have them today and tomorrow, but I think I can uh, do something a little better. I made soup last night, and I made way too much. I wound up with two big pots full of soup. So um, a lot of it's frozen, but I do have a lot of it still in the fridge. I like to freeze them in single portions so I can take it out whenever I want to have soup and just thaw it in the microwave and eat it. So... That will really help. I think I'm going to take some of that down today for lunch. So other than that, I'm, I want to stick to my five, five uh, workouts this week, Monday through Friday. Get them in. Um, just push through them. And um, I've been doing a squat challenge. I'm on like I'm almost done. I have like ten days left. Maybe today's my rest day, but so I want to keep up with that this week. And. Yeah, hopefully get my walks in at night still with Danica. She should be home. Well, she should have been home last night. I'm going to have to text her this morning, make sure she's okay. I will hopefully see you later in the week. Uh, well, I will see you, but hopefully I'll get to sit down and talk to you later in the week. And I'll look better than this and uh, feel better and sound better than this. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. This walk has been slow. I'm home to relax. I have just two more exercises left in my last set and then I'm done. This is the last thing I want to be doing right now. I am so tired. My walks today were so slow and ridiculous. Like, no energy. And so, this is... This is brutal. This is not what I want to be doing right now, but get her done, and then I can relax for the rest of the day. So, I'm looking forward to that. So, let's just get those two exercises done, and then be good to go. Officially done. I can relax for the rest of the day. <laughs> Yay! Everybody. So I'm done. All I did today because I am having trouble breathing because I have my cold in my throat but I wanted to still push really hard so all I did was I lowered my reps. I did the same amount of sets but I lowered my reps a little bit so I could still push hard on my reps instead of keeping my reps the same but not being able to push as hard as I would usually like. You can really do it either way. Um, but I thought I'd rather get them in really good and just do a little bit less. So that's what I did. I'm done for today. I'm probably going to get a walk or two on the treadmill because my steps are really low. I'm still sitting under 4,000 steps for the day and it's almost 4 o'clock. So I do need to get on the treadmill a little bit just to bring those steps up. But other than that, I'm doing good. I'm not feeling good. <laughs> But I'm doing good and I have some great goals for the beginning of October. I think I'll just talk about them quickly right now because I don't know if I'll be able to sit down with you. If I am able to sit down with you before the first, then I will and I just will delete this part so you won't even know. Anyway, so basically my goals, I'm keeping all the goals from last month. I 
did stick with every goal last month, except the only one I really failed on was eating a piece of fruit a day. I found that very hard. I didn't do that. So I am bringing that over this month as a new goal. Um, and I'm going to work really hard at that. I've upped my water. I wanted six cups a day. I'm up to eight. Um, I think I pretty much did that anyways this month, but I kind of want to try harder to get just more in or do the same as I'm doing. I don't want to fall back and quit that. Um, and I just really this month I'm going to focus on my diet a little bit more. My exercise is great. I've always been good at exercising. I love exercising. Um, food is my main problem. Um, so I have had some foods that I probably shouldn't have or that should have been cheat meals. So I'm going to really focus on one cheat meal per week. That is it. Everything else I need to be very strict. If I want to see the results that I want to see, I have to strict up my diet. So I'm really going to work on this that, that this month. My exercising, I want to get in my five workouts a week plus my walks as often and get all my steps in every day. So those are kind of my workout goals, kind of what I've already been doing, which should be fairly easy. So my main focus is going to be that one cheat meal a week. Yeah, I just really want to start getting those meals really strict because I haven't seen as much progress as I'd like. The bloat has definitely come out, but I definitely haven't seen the progress I wanted to this month. So I'm going to really work on that for October. So that's my goals. We got this. We all got this. No matter what your goals are, we have this. I mean, you just got to keep moving forward. You can't worry too much about the past. You just got to take a day at a time, a meal at a time, one step at a time. Do the Make the best decisions you can at this exact moment. Don't worry too far about the future. So that's what I'm really going to practice, what I preach this month for sure. And I'm going to push really hard. And hopefully next month you guys will see more results from me than this month. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hey everybody, so as you can see, so sweaty. I am um, at 56 minutes on the treadmill. I was doing, this is how we should. I uh, was doing walk for five minutes, run for one. Then when I got to a half hour, I was walking four minutes, running two. But when I got to 46 minutes, I decided to give it a four, yeah, four minute run. But I ran out of six for 10 minutes. <laughs> Hey everybody, so I did my run walk as you saw and now I'm like beat. I'm in bed and it's only like 6.30 and I just so done. I have to get up and feed the dogs but I'm like don't even want to get up and do that. Like I'm just ready to just pass out. I can't breathe so probably won't be able to pass out anyways but... So running probably wasn't the best idea, but I got my steps in, so I'm so happy. I uh, had sat down to eat some dinner, and I wasn't feeling very hungry, but I knew I had to eat, so I got some homemade soup out of the fridge, and I was going to eat that, but I took a couple spoonfuls, and I felt really sick to my stomach, and I had to stop, and then I had a couple more after it settled, and same thing, I felt sick, so I had to stop, and so I only got about half of it down, but um, I don't know what that's about, that's more of a flu symptom than a cold symptom, so I hope I'm not getting some mixed thing going on or whatever um but yeah and I also got a call today that I actually have my hair fixed tomorrow which I'm so excited about so hopefully it turns out better than last time I have a better experience uh so yeah I'll keep you guys updated on that hopefully I can get my workout done in the morning so that it's over with before I have to go get my hair done because I've been pretty tired once I get back from the salon especially if I'm still feeling like I am today so we'll see how things go and I will see you guys later I've only done one, but I'm laying here with Bowser because the roofers are redoing our roof and they brought up the shingles today. He doesn't like people or, like, he's very scared. He's a timid dog, so he's mm. wearing his, his stuff under shirt. Then he's getting snuggled to make him feel better. Monkey. Done my workup for today. Might jump on the treadmill for a little bit because I'm going to be sitting at the salon this afternoon. So I might just quickly just go for a walk before I shower and then be good to go for the day. Run slash walk time. Everybody, so I am 
drenched like drenched my shorts you can't tell but just soaked right through everywhere there's not a dry spot left on them <laughs> so i just finished on the treadmill i did an hour i did walk four minutes run two and i ran out of 5.8 i want to be at a six but i do have a bad knee so i have to take it easy um my lungs can do it i could run for a half hour straight my lungs um well not right now because i'm sick but <laughs> they're usually amazing like i have a great cinema but I have a bad knee, so I, that's something that I just have to work with. So I'm lucky to even be running. Um, I can't run outside. My knees will instantly hurt, so I have to run on the treadmill. But uh, it wasn't really my plans to start running. Just when I get on the treadmill, like, I love running. It's a passion of mine. I used to run all the time until my knee got really bad. So, yeah, I am so happy to be back at it and running again. And can't wait to get rid of this sickness. It's horrid. Um, but I'm still keeping up with my exercises, which is awesome. So I'm off to get ready because I'm going to be late getting to the salon. So I need to do that and get out of here. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Hey, everybody. So... Got my hair done. It looks so much better. It's so short because it was so fried from the last girl having to, that lifted it like three times and fried the crap out of it. Like, I have super short pieces everywhere in my hair that, like, there's just nothing you can do about it besides to totally chop your hair off. And we didn't really want to do that. So we took the back right out and we did an inverted bob. And then, um, we're just going to keep it short and get that all grown out and healthy again. So it's just a long process of just wait, waiting. <laughs> so it looks much better. It held the color much better. Before, there was a huge section right after she did it, all the way around my head right here that didn't take the color. And it's taken, there is a few chunks that didn't take it quite as well. But it is much better than before so we're just gonna have to work with it and see what we can do but I do like it a lot more now and I'm a lot happier but it is quite short compared to what I'm used to but that's okay <laughs> and um yeah so I'm very happy about that and I can't wait for it to grow out and be healthy again but I do love the color it's so pretty in real life like this doesn't do it any justice it is gorgeous just absolutely gorgeous color so I'm so happy and I got my workouts done, and as you guys saw, and yeah, and Tyler's coming home, so he's going to be home in the middle of the night tonight, so that should prove interesting for getting my workouts in, because we have to go visit his family and stuff tomorrow, so it'll have to be a later in the day kind of workout, but what do you do? And then my brother's here this weekend. We're going to have Thanksgiving early. Um, I am in Canada, so Thanksgiving's actually next, like not this weekend coming up, but the next one. But we're going to celebrate it this weekend because Tyler's in town and so is my brother. So him and his fiance and us and mom and dad and then um, a bunch of other family were having like a huge get together and I'm so excited. And I'm going to make pie. I probably won't eat it, but uh, I'll just eat dinner. I don't, uh, I'm, if I eat pie, I'll eat the pumpkin, but not the crust so we'll see but yeah so that's kind of the plan I will get my workouts in it'll just be kind of whenever I can so I will see you guys tomorrow one more set to go and I'm done for today. Just finished up my workout. I'm gonna jump on the treadmill and go for a run. See how I do. Done my run. Dripping. <laughs> um, dripping a lot. Um, so I did an hour again. I did the same thing as yesterday. I did run four, I mean walk four, run two for the whole hour. I was walking, I took it a little slower today because I really want to kick this cold, but so I don't want to push too hard. So I walked at a 3.8 and ran at a 5.5. So um, sh slowly but surely, I'm running and that's all I care about. I don't care how slow or how little, it just feels so good. So yay. One more set, and I'm done. And I'm done. 
So it's Friday, so that means my workouts, besides like walking and getting my steps in, are done for the week. So yay! See you guys later. I'm gonna hop on the treadmill, so I will get a quick snippet of that. Hey everybody, so I'm just on my treadmill, getting a quick little walk in. Um, I've had a good weekend, lots of family, friends, relaxed, ate a bit too much. So tomorrow is back at it and yeah, because I had a fun weekend but I definitely, definitely paid for it. I didn't do near enough exercise and ate way too much. but. Don't feel guilty about it. I enjoyed myself and I'm back at her tomorrow. So I will see you guys tomorrow.